this cool looking guy is Norman. Norman's ID number is A489433. And Norman is an Irish wolfhound, Griffon Mix. He's two years old and he came into the shelter as a stray on November 5th from the Azusa area. Uh, Norman is about 60 pounds, but uh, he is a little bit malnourished, we think, so he'll probably get a little bit bigger when he's loved and fed like he should be. Uh, he is a really cool guy. He's big, but he's gentle, and uh, he's just uh, kind of a, a love bug. He's fearful in the shelter, but it's an environment that's not really suited to his gentle personality. So once he gets out of here and gets with a loving home, he's really going to open up. He's actually opened up a tremendous amount since he's been out of his kennel. Um, he really has started to trust his handler, as you can see here. Um, they've spent some time together, and the more time they spend together, he just gets more and more um, loyal and trusting to her. So once he gets into a home and knows that uh, he's part of your family, he's just going to become more and more loyal and loving. And we think that Norman's the kind of dog that is really going to be appreciative of getting out of the shelter environment. Uh, he's probably lived a lot of his life um, outside, so um, you want to make sure that you are able to give him lots of exercise, but uh, he, he would thrive where he can stay inside the home and then just go out on occasion for exercise and walks, etc. But he definitely deserves to be inside and loved on and babied. Um, he's really cool. He's really unique. Um, I haven't seen too many dogs that look like Norman here, and uh, that's a really cool thing. Um, so. Uh, he's going to be the dog that you're walking around and everybody's admiring, asking you what he is, and uh, he's just really going to open up as people start to love him and uh, treat him like he deserves. And anything else you can say about Norman? That um, he definitely has shown a lot of improvement since I got him out of the kennel. At first he was just cowering in the corner of his kennel, um, but once I coaxed him out and had him walk around, he's been following me, um, sitting here on my lap, um, sidling up next to me. I think he trusts he trusts easily once he knows that the person who's going to handle him wants to take care of him and wants to love him. Um, and um, he also showed signs of being housebroken too, so um, I, even though he kind of looks like he's been outside most of the time, um, it seems he does have a concept of going to the bathroom where he should, because um, his kennel was clean, so um, he went potty right when he left the kennel. Um, He's been interested in other dogs as well, um, even though he's scared here, he's gone up to meet other dogs and been very polite with them, so if you have a dog at home, um, I mean definitely with proper introduction, um, he might like to have a canine companion at home too. So he's a really great dog and uh, I'm sure he's just going to feel so happy and so grateful um, to go home with you um, if you're looking for a new best friend. He's a great dog. Yeah, and he definitely looks relaxed and uh, comfortable with you. Yeah, so he's, <laughs> um, he's going to be... Uh, just really, like you said, somebody's best friend. He's got those big, uh, I would say, soulful eyes, actually. Uh, For sure. He's, uh, he's a really unique guy, and he deserves a special home. So come on down. Meet Norman. At the, he's trying to say bless you. Thank um, you. Yeah, he's, he's considerate, too. That's a good thing. So come on down. Meet Norman. Take him home with you, and just uh, welcome him to your forever home. Bye-bye. He's at the Baldwin Park Shelter.